I had so much fun filming after the kids went to bed with a glass of wine, so I decided to have a little girls night again and talk Amazon accessories that I've recently picked up. Besides the kind of trendy shoes, I would say most of these are basics that you will have in your closet for a long time and you can wear year after year. If you are new to my channel, my name is Deandra. Welcome. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Let's hang out, have some fun. I hope you decide to hit that subscribe button down below. I would love it so much if you joined our little fam here. Let's get on with our girls night. This video is sponsored by Share A Card. Seriously, this web extension has become my most used. I never knew that I needed it, but once I got it, I was obsessed. <laughs> Basically, you can share your cart wherever you're shopping. You can curate items into your cart and share it with anyone else with one link. My mom and I in the past would like just give each other our login info so that I could see what was in her cart. But now all I have to do is curate it, send her the link and she can see everything that's in my cart, add whatever she wants to her cart. And then that way, you know, if we're shopping the same thing like for the kids which mostly is what we're doing you maybe have a mother's day list you can curate one at your favorite store and just send it over to your husband or whoever it just makes it so easy to shop with other people and it's so easy it doesn't check out for you you do have to add all those things and go through the checkout process so you're not inserting any of your information into another website i definitely recommend that you check it out. I will be linking everything I talk about today in a share a cart for you guys to shop. You can add whatever's in my cart into your cart and it just makes it so much easier. So thank you to share a cart for sponsoring this video. Now let's talk about what's in my share a cart. <laughs> I want to start off with handbags because I have three shoes and handbags I'm so addicted to. I buy so many. I literally have two on the way for my next Walmart haul. But the ones that I got from Amazon are amazing. And so let me just let me just bring them out. I actually ended up sharing this one right here on my community tab here on YouTube. The plaid is beautiful. The color is beautiful. I love the red stripe. It has a sort of different pattern on the other side. It is sort of floppy though. It's not a super thick canvas fabric, but I kind of like that because it kind of feels a little bit more casual. I could totally wear this to the beach. I could take this on a road trip. If I bought an insert, I could also use it as like a laptop bag because it does have a wide bottom and lots of room on the inside. So all in all, I would say this was totally worth buying. It's not just a trendy piece. I mean, it resembles a very classic brand. So I'm very happy with this purchase. It does have a zipper pocket on the inside and then it does have the two easy access pockets. Let's talk about this one first because I haven't shared it anywhere. Actually, I did in just a photo on TikTok. In the Amazon description, it said that this was a medium size, but I would definitely say this is a small, if not extra small size bag, but it's very trendy. It again, resembles a very high end brand and I love the knot. I love that it's black. The woven texture is beautiful. Fabric is super soft. It resembles real leather. I'm very much in love with her. She's gorgeous. This bag, however, does have a standalone TikTok. Again, if you guys don't follow me on Instagram or TikTok, go follow me on both because I do try to share different content on each platform so they get sneak peeks like this top. I just shared it on Instagram and I'll probably share it on TikTok a few days later. So I do try to 
keep all of my socials a little bit spicy so you guys aren't getting repetitive content on each platform. But anyways, this bag is gorgeous. It's actually a denim fabric where it's quilted and then everywhere else is like a cream faux leather. The gold hardware is really, really nice. It does have mermaids that are holding probably a pearl or something right in the middle. The chain isn't my favorite, I'm not gonna lie. It does get a little tangled as you can see, but I'll probably end up just wearing this as a crossbody. If it really gets on my nerves that much, I could probably just remove it and buy a better quality one. But honestly, for $30, this is a amazing bag. So this is what the inside looks like. It is two different pockets and there's not any extra like zipper pockets or easy access pockets, but honestly, I don't ever use those. <laughs> I'm so bad, I'm disorganized. I just throw everything in my bag. Let's go ahead and talk shoes because I do have two in front of me. I have had on my wish list forever. First off, this tan pair of lug sole boots are so, so good. The faux suede is really, really nice. I love how it has this this like cloth ribbed fabric in the ankle area. It makes it very easy to get on and off. Very, very comfortable pair of shoes. I'm probably gonna try and style them on TikTok tomorrow. They are true to size and come in many, many different colors. Gorgeous pair of lug sole boots. I know that these are very trendy. They were such a great Amazon find. This next pair is a very trendy pair of shoes. Again, these are designer inspired. They're actually by Madden Girl, which is a branch of Steve Madden. They are a nude jelly pair of square toe slip on sandals. They do have a little bit of a platform. I know that platforms are so trendy this season, but these are just a little bit more practical for day to day where I can wear with jeans and a cute little top. I'm obsessed, they look like a pair of Barbie shoes and I love Barbie. I used to play with Teresa all the time. She was my girl. I did order these in a size six. They are true to size. They're actually pretty comfortable to walk in. I cannot wait to wear these. You will be seeing these many, many, many more times on my channel, I guarantee that. My next favorite accessory to buy is sunglasses, hands down. I was going through Amazon's viral products list and I came across these yellow aviators, which I have been seeing all over the place. They are so trendy for this upcoming season. They give you a nice 70s retro vibe. I'm into them. It was actually cheaper for me to buy the two pack than it was for me to buy just the one style. So you know I got the two pack. It came with a black fade lens. It's the exact same style and it is so cute. Like if you want something, you know, that's a little bit more casual, less trendy, you got two for less than the price of one. So I'm really loving the black fade style as well. It's very flattering on my face. They're very comfortable. $17 for two pairs of sunglasses is a really great deal. So I wasn't sure about these, honestly, when I bought them, but when I put them on, I really like them. So, oh, my necklace is crazy. Okay, so honestly, I tied the two necklaces together. Like, have you seen that Instagram hat where people tie them together and it just makes one necklace that you can adjust? I have never found a way for it to not slide around. I feel like it gets tangled when I try that hack. Anyway, speaking of necklaces, I did just pick up this chain again. I ended up buying a smaller one. Talked about it in my Amazon jewelry video. I will link my Amazon hauls place list down below if you want to check out any of my old Amazon videos but I really love this chain and they have so many styles listed it never tarnished on me the only thing is that the round part on the clasp just kept falling off so I ordered a new 
one. I did get it a little bit smaller, but it is such high quality. I do everything in my Amazon necklaces. I sleep in them, I work out in them. The only thing is that I don't shower in them, but all of my necklaces that you ever see me wearing are from Amazon. I have a whole jewelry list, so go check it out if you're ever curious about what jewelry I'm wearing. Most likely it's listed there. I did also pick up these three hoop earrings. I've seen a lot of people wearing these and I'm so glad that I bought them because they are so cute. They feel heavy and they look expensive, but they were not expensive and I'm kind of obsessed with them. So we'll see how they wear, but most of my Amazon jewelry again has not tarnished on me. I literally bought a nine pack of hoop earrings and I keep them everywhere. They have not tarnished on me or anything. I love them so much. If you ever see me wearing big hoop earrings, it's probably from my nine pack. I really love these too. I'll also link that nine pack down below because again, it's a good pack of basics that I would just wear all the time. I did need some more huggies for my second hole. I kind of want to get a third hole. Can you order? an ear piercing gun on Amazon. It's so bad. I'll probably end up with so many ear piercings. Oh, you can order an ear piercing kit. I was in need of some Huggies for my second hole. And so of course I bought a multi-pack of little hoop Huggies. I mostly bought this one because of this specific Huggy. It has a moon here and a star on the other side. And I just thought that that was so cute, but it also has this basic pair with the rhinestone huggy and just the plain gold huggy. This set is not basic at all. It's actually very trendy. So it has the rope style huggy, the V style huggy, and then the rectangle style. I just thought all of these together were so cute. So I did also want to talk about my watch band because I haven't really talked about it and I've been wearing it for months, months. If you guys go back to any of my old videos, you will see this on my wrist. I love it so much. It was so affordable. It looks so high end. It even came with the faceplate cover, which I appreciate because my watch is a rose gold and I don't really like mixing like yellow gold with rose gold so the fact that it makes my watch face look gold I love that about it again it hasn't tarnished it fits well it's comfortable it does actually come with the tools that you need to remove the links I've mentioned these I think in an unboxing video but let's just talk about these bangles since I'm wearing them these two came together with another one that's like a rope style kind of wanted to keep it simple so I just went with these two bangles this one actually has the Roman numerals I wash my hands wearing all of my jewelry on a daily basis and none of them have tarnished I did also get this tennis bracelet that has the rectangle cut rhinestones very very cute and I've been wearing this nonstop. We recently were with a lot of family and my cousins kept asking me about my phone strap. They have a whole bunch of these little wrist straps on Amazon that makes it easy just to carry your phone around. You just connect it to your phone case. You can just attach it wherever feels the most comfortable for you. But for me, it was on the bottom. I really like these because I need my hands to be free a lot of the time, but I also don't always Always have pockets that I can fit it into. This really just prevents me from dropping my phone. I really liked that they were just a basic bejeweled look rather than the beaded smiley face ones that I've been seeing. I do like those, but sometimes I want something that's just, you know, a little bit more basic. Super, super cute. Comes in a clear black and pink. So jeans are not technically accessories, but I am so obsessed with these that I have to share them with you now instead of waiting for a clothing haul because they're just that good. I did a whole series on Instagram about finding my right size. It kind of was a hassle, but once I got it right, oh my gosh. 
They are so good. They feel like designer jeans where they come kind of stiff, but once you wear them around and break them in, they just morph to your body so perfectly. These were the most amazing Amazon find. I did also order the blue pair, which I have shared on both Instagram and TikTok. The two of them are sort of different though, because the blue pair has a button closure where the black pair has a zipper. Also, I ordered the size small in the black pair and they fit perfectly, but I had to size down to an extra small in the blue pair for them to fit the same. I did do a try on of what the small looked like in the blue on Instagram. Also, I ordered these in the extra small and they would not go past my thighs. So sizing is definitely tricky, but it really is worth the time to try to find the pair that fits you and wear them around and kind of break them in because you will be living in them. I've been living in them. They're the perfect length for me for both tennis shoes and heels. I'm only 5'1", so that does not happen to me often. Again, I'm wearing a a small in the black and an extra small in the blue. Also, I wanted to talk about these fleece tights. I know I have mentioned them in a clothing haul and my unboxing video, but these really are the most genius product. Again, you'll have these for years and years. You can wear them in the spring with cute little skirts. You can also wear them next year during the holidays. It really is worth the buy. They're so soft on the inside and they look like basic, you know, sheer tights, but they also give you the warmth so you're not like shivering when you're going out and stuff. These went viral for a reason, you guys. They're amazing. They're totally worth picking up on Amazon. I'm glad I have these for those days where I'm itching to wear my spring clothes, but it's not quite right with the weather. <laughs> what is the spring trend you're most excited for? Comment down below because I'm very curious. I know that I'm loving all the bright colors. This top is also from Amazon. Oh, I'll go ahead and link that for y'all as well. I'm out of wine. I hope you enjoyed this video because I definitely had fun hanging out with you tonight. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.